Hey guys, and welcome back to Clock Tower. When we last left off, Clock Tower 2, I should say. When we last left off, we got horribly murdered. Um, and we got the worst ending of the game. And, like, I've had a look at a few things in this game, and I'm really not 100% sure what we're supposed to be doing. I did look up a couple of guides, but... They just seem incredibly complicated. Ooh, spooky. So that still doesn't do anything. Okay. Now, there, there is some stuff that I've read about that statue, but... I don't know, man. It, it seems a bit weird. Right, now, apparently, with this lock, this amulet... We can put it in places. You've put down the amulet. Cool. But we can only put it in certain places. And it's kind of confusing. Like, it, this game basically revolves around um, trial and error, which is kind of a pain in the ass. So. I'm not really sure what we're going to do. I think we're just going to sit down and try and get through it the best we can. I have looked up some requirements of getting the best ending in the game. Um, and basically, to get the best ending in the game, like if you've never played it before and you're using it uh, and you're, you're going in blind, it's impossible. You're not going to get it. There is such a complicated list of things and events that you have got to do in a precise, very meticulous order to get the best ending. So. I'm, I might try and do it. I might try and get the best ending. But thoughts of going through this game blind and um, getting a good ending like you could do with the first game. No, not so much in this one. So that door was locked. Okay. That's cool. But unfortunately, we've, there's 13 endings in this game. And only one has a proper cutscene. Like FMV ending. And that's the best ending. Stop. Stephanie, stop, please. Right. Okay, now... I'm, right, here's what I'm hoping is going to happen. I'm hoping we're going to push her off. We're then going to um, become bait because we don't have the amulet anymore. And then we can use the gun. Another thing that I found out that the game doesn't tell you. Only bait can use guns. I know. I didn't understand either, but there we go. This game is incredibly cryptic. So let's drop down a save anyway. We also, in this particular run, we already cannot get the best ending. Because when we went into one of the bedrooms, we saw one of our relatives stabbed to death in the chair. If you see that body, you can't get the best ending. I don't know what we did. I, I don't know. So, yeah. Um, but let's just keep going, seeing if this is going to work. The only other thing I can think about doing, guys, is putting this LP on hold after this video. I'm playing the game quite a lot and actually, like, learning it a little bit. Right, let's try this. Okay, Alyssa, you bitch. Let's see what happens now. I don't know if this is going to work. Come on, we don't have the amulet anymore. We don't have the amulet anymore. Come on. Oh, there we go. Hurry up, old lady. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. A little twerp. I'll kill her next time. Oh, I like bait. Bait's cool. So he just like kicked her in the face. Ooh, me likey. 
That was cool. So that little monster. Uh, right. I mean, cool. So we survived. That's a good thing. And we also saved our friend as well. But I don't know where she is. Ah, now we're bait. Apparently, let's try the gun. Let's see how this works. Oh. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I kind of see how the gun mechanic works now. Oh, <laughs> I like that. I like that. So you actually have to aim at her with the cursor. Alright. That's interesting. However, we're kind of fucked now. We still have the gun. The gun isn't quite as good as I was hoping it to be. Now, how many shots? Can we, like, get further away? Now, how many shots do we get? Or how many does it take to sh kill her? Or injure her, I should say. Come on, you little bitch. In your own damn time? Honestly. You fucking die of old age waiting for her to come in. Hello? Right this way. Is she not going to come in because she knows we've got the gun? Is that what's happening? Hmm. Come on. She's not going to bloody come in now, is she? Um. Ah, oh, fuck. Here she comes. Right. Right, you little bitch. Uh, wait, what? No, that's that's bullshit. <laughs> I guess we're dead. Ah, different game over. Cool. Okay. All right. So if we die, the game just puts us back here. That's. Kind of good to know. And we have more health. Which is nice. Why can't we... Use the gun? Okay, I don't know why we can't use the gun. I'm not really sure what's going on here. Can we... Nah. Nope, we're fucked. We're fucked. We can't use the gun when we go into this state either. Hmm. Well, nice try. Nice try. We we tried to survive, but it didn't work. Right, let's come over here. Must be able to use this gun somehow. It's not easy to select. Oh! Oh, okay. Uh, I don't know. I've, I'm not really sure how that worked, to be honest, but I guess it worked. Um, okay, now, is there anything in here? There's got to be something in here, surely. Oh, first aid kit. I mean, that's pretty nice, to be fair. Can't go wrong with a first aid kit, I guess. But, is that... Is that all that's in here, though? That ain't no good. We need more than a first aid kit. I suppose we, we saved um, that woman. I forget her name. And to be honest, I don't really give a shit about her name either. Uh, I very much doubt that's important. So this gun will technically allow us to uh, escape her 
four more times, but only if we're bait. I don't know. That's such. That's such a weak game mechanic. Like, I like the whole thing um, with the changing personalities. That's quite cool, but the way it's implemented is really bad. Really bad. You should just be able to switch at any point. Um, like, taking, taking your amulet off and having to put it in a cupboard or something, and then remembering where it is, that's rubbish game design. So says I. Now, let's go change back to bait. So it's, and also, um, yes, it's not enough to just, it's not enough to just um, take the amulet off as well. You have to get stressed. Now, I think you can drop the amulet off in just about any container. Or just about anything that you can physically search. But it it's not, like, it's not super clear. So, I'm not sure. Whether it's everything you can search or any certain things, I don't know. Now, let's... Tr oh, phone's going again. It's quite funny because I found two guides for this game and both of the guides that have an intro uh, both mention how awfully bad this game is. Which I thought was quite funny. Uh, can we go in here? So that door's still locked. So we need to find her somehow. We're not going to search the clock because... That just makes that attack us. And I don't know if we need to do that. I don't know if you have to activate those those traps. I'm pretty sure you don't. Say, so, uh, not a huge... Ah, oh, there's another gun in there. Uh, I'm not exactly an expert of this game. But I know a little bit more than I did. And I do mean a little bit more. Right, so I'm guessing she's run back upstairs. Come on, Alyssa. Uh, I'm guessing we can't go outside. Can't search that one. It's infuriating that you can carry the gun around with you, but you can't use it. Like, why? Seriously, why? That... Uh. Let's not worry about it. We cannot change the things that be. Now, where did this woman run off to? She's not here. For instance, this here. We can um, we can put the amulet there. Didn't actually want to do that. There we go. Alright, now where would this girl or this woman run off to? She could be like literally anywhere. I think that's going to be... Um, what? Oh, blood on the table. Ah! I remember reading about this blood. If there's blood on the table here, it means... There's something that we can't do. And to that end, let's save data two. I wonder what this is. Well, it's blood. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, hello. Are you back again? Seriously, you need to like fuck off and leave us alone. 
Honestly. Can we not? Oh! Who's that? Shit, that's the woman. That's not good. Uh, can we... No, I guess we've got nothing here that we can use. And we can't use the gun. So... Go through here, I guess. So the woman that we just saved is already dead. Okay. Uh, is there something in here that we can use? Uh, I mean, there's that. Oh, we can use this. That's cool. Now, I guess we need to go examine her body. Good night, bitch. Oh, I wonder if Bait can touch that statue. Ooh. Trouble. Okay, that's um, maybe. Thing is, if Bait can touch that. Hmm. Let's find out. Trouble is, even if we take the amulet off, we still need a stressful situation to turn into bait. Unless... Hmm. Unless... That statue... Allows us to turn into bait, maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I really don't like the way that you have to take the amulet off and then put it somewhere. That's really stupid. Now, let's go see if we can touch the statue now we don't have the amulet. Oh, also those hints that you pick up. I've read all the hints as well. They're all garbage. None of them actually help. And in fact, the final hint, number eight, is a joke. And says something silly like, there's no more hints in the game. You must try the best you can. Oh, I can't touch it. But why? So, no. Hmm. Okay, so we still need more keys then. I wonder if Alyssa's got a... Is it Alyssa? No, we're Alyssa, I think. I don't know. All their names are stupid. Um... Let's go and so let's go through here. It's not through there, is it? It's through there. Let's go check the uh, woman's body. So I'm wondering if she had a key. I suppose it doesn't really matter which... Actually, if we go through that door. It should take us straight to the body. Should, being the operative word here. Right, there we go. Aunt Catherine. So that was Catherine. She's dead. Yes, you can see that. Oh. Oh. So if we search the body, um, that's an instant game over. Okay. Good to know, I guess. So I'm wondering if we need to find Philip then. Maybe. So is that the same as ending F? No, ending M. 
Oh, so that's a, that is actually a different ending. That's ending L. So... I'm guessing then, 11, uh, or there's 13 endings. So I'm guessing we get the one true ending, and then 12 endings that are just going to be that, I guess. Where we get killed? Maybe? Hmm. So if I go to pamphlet, ending list, so yeah, we've got, we've already got two of them, I suppose. Um, that's quite lazy, because in Clock Tower 1, there was ten endings, but I think they actually, um, they were all cinematics, or they all changed the actual cinematic at the end to some degree. Hmm. Okay, that's kind of curious. So I'm guessing... Because we've been everywhere. Unless we have to search... Unless we have to examine her body as bait. Which is possible. And I actually know maybe... How we can become bait. Maybe. Let's try this. Um, right, so we're not going to search that. We want to... Because we want to become bait. Um, I'm definitely... Yeah, I could definitely see why this was really... Not very well um, received. Bearing in mind that this game's two years newer than Clock Tower 1. It doesn't feel like there's been like any innovation. It feels like it's still the same graphics. It's still the same point-and-click interface. I mean, they've added guns as well, but like... They don't... I don't know. It's just... Hmm. I'm not sure about this game, actually, guys. Right, so we don't... Oh, we still have the amulet. Oh, oh, although... I wonder... Can we put the amulet in there? We can. It's just... It's little things like that are just so bizarre. Right, if we get stressed out here, can we become bait? Let's try and see what happens. So we're just going to mash X. There we go. Ah, and here she comes. No, because... No, no, no. We're still not... Oh, man. No, 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 no. Don't run into her. We can use the candlesticks, apparently. Ooh. Now we're bait. Cool. Right. That's what I wanted to know. Well, that's what we wanted, I should say. Okay. Now let's go examine the body upstairs. Yeah, and Scissor Man was such a cool enemy. Like, he really was. We can't use anything here. Let's use the gun. There we go. <laughs> Bitch. Don't run downstairs. Yeah, and she'll take a random um, exit point by the look of things. Which is kind of annoying as well. Um... Right, so now we're bait. Can we examine things a little bit differently? Because he's a little bit more hardcore. Right. 
Right, let's save. And see what happens. See, as bait, we can't even examine that as bait. Um, okay. It's kind of anticlimactic. But we can examine her. Right. She bit it. She that little crud bitch. <laughs> little crud bitch. Oh, so we still die even as bait. Hmm. Okay. I'm guessing even though we were bait, that's still ending L. Hmm. Okay. Right. In that case, what I might do, guys? Um, yeah, ending rank is L. Cool. Okay. I might leave this here for now. And when I get some time... I might play this a little bit and try and learn it because I don't have time to do that now. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. This game's going to be rough, I think. It's going to be very rough. See, with the first game, I was drawing maps and all kinds of stuff. Man, we did that so long ago. Was that six years ago now? Something like that? Christ. But, uh, I don't know. The other one was quite an enjoyable game. The story is quite interesting. Maybe the story is good in this one. I'm, I'm not. <laughs> that's not why I've read. But we can dream. We can dream. Um, yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna learn this one a little bit, uh, and then I'm gonna come back to it. And maybe we we'll go for an a ending. I'm not sure because we've already blown it. Like, if I load those games, we cannot get an A ending. And I don't know what we've done. Uh, as I said, to get the, the best ending in the game, you have to be perfect and, and do this whole laundry list of things spot on, which you're never going to guess without a guide. It's just, there's just no way. There's too many things that can go wrong. Um, I know on the first... Act, which is what we're technically on. There's, I think, there's five endings, four or five endings, just on that, and we've got two of them. So, well, technically, yeah, there's there's five or six ways to finish the first act. Because, um, yeah, obviously you continue, and then there's four actual endings. So, yeah. Lots of trial and error. Although this is quite a short game. I mean, you can easily bust it out in a couple of hours from what I've read. I think there's going to be many, 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 many hours of, of just trial and error. And I think I'm going to have to write myself out a little list of things. What works and what doesn't. Which obviously I could record, but it's going to be an awful lot of this and dying. So, yeah, I might I might leave this here for now anyway, guys. So, interesting game. Definitely doesn't hold a candle to the second one so far. Oh, the first, well, yeah, technically the second one so far. But uh, we will persevere and we will finish it. But it's going to take me um, some time, okay? Yeah. <sighs> The things I do for you guys, honestly. Till next time, guys.